So these are a peritiba, so a very Italian tradition of small, starting with small bites at the bar before dinner. Uh, I just enjoyed it over cocktails, over wine, but more importantly, it's just a wonderful end of the day and a wonderful start to the beginning. So this one's got a crunch factor for sure. Let's see what we got. Huh. So big. This is beautiful. So much food's gonna come my way tonight. I'm so excited. Yeah. This is some of my favorite bread in town. It is so good. I'll do some dipping shortly, but let's get a crunch factor going. We're gonna finish over here with an infusion of our water. Uh, mainly made with capers, but the chef would recommend you to enjoy it with a bite of the two. He's saucing me up. Scampi alla Romana. So, this is the New Zealand langoustine, done over charcoal and then layered with a thin ribbon of the guanciale to the gel bacon to give some smokiness to the dish. So it's sort of these almost two perfect bites on either end. Risotto cacio e limone. So pecorino calabrese and pecorino romano. Fermented and dried Persian lime. So just a, a regular lime as a reference, but after you do the drying process, that's what it looks like. And rather than crack black pepper, cracking that lime. Whoa. Zest rather than spice. Fantastic. Truffle away, chef. Make it rain. Beautiful ravioli. I mean, I should probably cut this, but you know me. <laughs> mm. Mm. Yeah. Green apple dressing, that's pretty cool. Literally. So we start here with the first uh, entree. We have our, uh, we can say now our signature dish. It's gonna be our branzino, uh, Mediterranean sea bass. We dry age it for 48 hours. So here's the lamb chop. It's got a bone in it. Finger food, right? If it's got a bone. Of course. There you go. I've been given permission. <laughs> Finger food. I have manners. I just leave them at home. This might be my favorite cheese course in all of America. A little honey crackers. We've got white chocolate encrusted creamy cheese. It's great stuff. Beautiful cow. This is Fiola. Palate cleansing is possible with bubble sweetness and a little bit of herbal. We're looking for a fig leaf soda here. Final desserts. That is all under this. <laughs> Look at what's going down. Five hours plus. Here we go. Yes, we're doing it. This is their tiramisu in the shape of Italy. I'm going to pretend it's a J. So thoughtful. They made something just for me, Joel. Oh. 